exhibition um, took about two and a half years to put together. Um, it's a ROM uh, created exhibition, but obviously all these objects are coming from the area of Pompeii and the Museum of Archaeological Heritage at, in Naples and the storerooms of the Pompeii site itself. We're very fortunate to have been loaned so many beautiful objects. We are here from Legions 30, 24 and 2 and we're here to show everyone how fun and exciting it is to be here for the Pompeii exhibit. exhibitions I've been to Pompeii before and it was just such a, a magnificent city that everything was just so well preserved and everything and I just I wish I could have seen more and I just wasn't there for enough time and this exhibit is just really amazing just going through the history and how everything works and about the volcano and everything and I'm just really interested in this ancient city that was just buried alive for the most part. We came to the ROM tonight to enjoy the Pompeii exhibit um, because it's a toga party and we like to have fun. Um, the coolest thing about the exhibit so far has been the sculptures and the incredible um, articles that have survived from the eruption of Mount Vesuvius. One of my favourite objects is actually an intricate floor mosaic showing some seafood, some marine life. What I love about it is the fact that although I've seen pictures of it time and time again, this is the first time I've been able to see it up close in this exhibition and actually see how it has been made out of tiny, tiny cubes of natural stone of different colours created to put together in a bed of cement to make an intricate and beautiful object. Definitely very interesting. It shows you a lot of uh, pieces of history um, and like the preservation it makes such beautiful pieces and it's very, very interesting. <laughs> and the Romans really did influence our just every everyday life and it's amazing just to see the similarities between Pompeii and modern society as well. Yeah. So it's really and you get to learn so many new things, so, which is really cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Always a learning experience. <laughs> Something that we're very excited about is the fact that for the first time outside Italy we are actually getting some copies of the body casts that have never before travelled. They are made using the new 3D printing technology after 3D scanning and this is their first, this, their debut outside um, Italy. Um, I'm having a great time. I've personally, I, I was just, I just came back from Italy a few months ago. So just seeing it firsthand in my own city is truly amazing. It's been wonderful. I think it's great. Um, I, there's a bit of a documentary on this, so it's kind of nice to see it um, in person and um, get to see all the neat different uh, things that they found. Yeah, there's so much history here and so much to learn, so I suggest if any of you are thinking of coming out, then make sure you do. exhibit and uh, I made these crowns today for us and we're wearing our bed sheets so that we're on theme. Toga toga. <laughs>